Hey Greg, how are you? Um, so let's see, I found a few problems um, why things probably weren't working right. So I'm just going to quickly go over uh, what, what we can do. So first off, uh, we don't need these three rows. Actually, you don't need that one either because these are all going to be dynamically generated when somebody um, fills up a Groupon or you know uses a Groupon code. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, delete these columns. Um, quick, delete the entire columns. Okay. Um, one thing that was happening is there was a space right here too. And that make sure you remove the space. There, I was just going to come up with a call a column name or a field field name missing or something like that. So then remove all that stuff and hit save. And then you'll come over here to to your PHP my admin. This is yours, by the way. Let me go ahead and hit import. And I'm going to browse for this file that we just modified. And it'll automatically choose Excel. Go ahead and put column names in the first row, and then hit go. So yeah, this is that page that you were seeing before. Now what that actually did was it created a new table down here um, and added some rows into it. I already, I already deleted the old table that you created, had created probably by doing this. So if we go in here and look, there's our, there's our Groupon codes. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and export this. And usually you might want to save it as a file um, because it could get uh, you know, it could get pretty big if you have thousands of Groupon codes. So, but I'm just going to output it to the screen, and then I'm going to come over here and copy this data here. I'm going to then I'm going to open up. Uh, I usually use um, use Dreamweaver. I'm going to paste this this uh, SQL code in here. I'm going to copy. I'm going to, actually, I'm going to find and replace every instance of Sazen, Spog, Coupons, Eleven, or whatever. And then I want to make sure that we have the right table that these are going to go into um, here. And you can just grab that from, oh, where is it right here? I just copied it from there, paste it in here. The reason I'm doing this is because you could have thousands of Groupons. I don't know. But what it'll do, it'll, it'll break up the insert it'll bring up the inserts into multiple inserts and so you need to make sure that every insert group has the, the proper uh, the right table name so you just hit replace all it'll go through and replace them and you can save this as an SQL file or you know or, or your modified SQL file that you just downloaded just anyways go ahead and uh, come back into here into your PHP my admin go to SQL or you can go do import. Eh, I would I would just do SQL and just paste them all in there. Hit go, and it inserted your new rows. And let's see here, you have your new Groupon codes added. I know it's a little bit weird. But this the reason I have to do it this way is because people, you know, they always they add a bunch of junk in there, and it usually ends up crashing the. PHP code or something. I'm trying to work out a better way of doing it. But anyways, hope this helps. Um, let me know if you have any questions. Thanks.